Okay guys, so today I'm going to show you how to download your images to your desktop. Um, after you order your stills or your virtual tour package, the day after your scheduled shoot, you will get an email that looks um, similar, if not exactly identical to this. Um, so we always include the instructions for downloading, but this is kind of a lot to read, so this is just going to be a nice and easy visual way to go about it. Um, the first thing you'll do is click on this stills link here. This is through Dropbox, but you do not have to have an account in order to do this. You'll see all your images here. Let's say you click on one to kind of go through um, just to review. And after you're thinking they look good, do not click on the download in the upper right hand corner here because what that's going to do is just download that single image since you're, you selected one. So you're going to want to make sure you return to this screen right here that shows all the images before you go to the upper right hand corner and click download. You'll download that as a zip file. Make sure it's on save. Hit OK. Um, let's see, for the, so I have a setting on my computer to pop up and ask me where I want it to save each time I download a file. So for the sake of the video, we want to eventually get it to desktop. So for the sake of the video, um, you will probably have it sent to downloads. So I'll go ahead and save it there. So if you didn't have that pop up, no worries, you will get a um, blue arrow, this is the download symbol. It'll either be up here in the top right hand corner or the bottom left hand corner, depending on which browser you're using. So you go ahead and select that, you click on the small folder, that will show you where it goes. So right here we have the stills, I'm going to go ahead and move them to the desktop because that's where we want them. You can disregard that little thing there. So once you've done that, you'll come here to your desktop. Here's the file. Move that right there, just so you can see it better. Now, because this is a zip file, it's um, slightly compressed for download. And you'll want to go to Extract All. It's going to be right below Open. So you'll hit that. You'll make sure it's on desktop still. You can see that there. You'll click Extract. And then, just like that, you'll have all of your images and they will be on your desktop. Let's see, you can go back here. It'll just create another one that does not have the little zipper on it. So once you check out your images, you see they're good, they're good quality, you can go back and you can actually just delete that zip folder if you'd like because now your folder um, is good to go. Those are all high quality images that you can upload directly to MetroList. Alright, and that's really all there is to it. Thanks guys!